Alright, so we have to go back, right? So... I have to go back. I guess that... I, I hate those guys. Yeah, because they've got the paralysis. Oh! Okay. Okay, what is this? That's a lot of enemies, actually. Wow. That's a lot of enemies. Holy shit. Wow, I... Okay. Um, my person is a boy. <laughs> Shira is fantastic, and her S-Craft. Yeah, no, she's like, yeah, she's got the whip. <laughs> okay, those... They don't seem to be... Oh, God. Oh, God. What's happening in this fight? It's hard. Oh, I have to use water, I guess, guy. Water. water. Wait, no, no, that wasn't was water. What am I doing? That wasn't water. I've got bleed. I've got bleed. Ooh, okay, I need to use an item here. Um What is the one that cures the um What's the one that cure okay that uh yep. Oh, ouch. I have to move, I have to move, man. I, I, uh. Wow! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, 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 yes, bad. Oh, she went for Stella. Oh, wow. No, sorry, no, sorry, no, uh, Chloe, man. Oh, on her again, are you kidding me? What's it do that? Oh, what is that? Oh, no. Hello, hero. Oh, yeah, no, I was talking about you uh, before hero, yeah, because, um, what's it called? Um, I think it was Paul or Pichu. Somebody here was saying that, yeah, they, 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 uh, they were playing through um, East 8 and East 9 as well.
Oh, what? <laughs> I thought you loved it. <laughs> what? Bruh. Um... Okay, oops. Someone's been naughty. Uh, I could feel a book with Stella's quotes of quality in idea. She's got a lot of good um, quotes for sure. Yeah, she's a she's a, just a fun character. But she's just a session character. Uh, you can use anti step to stop them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I need to be using that. Yeah, I need to be using that more often. I, I just sometimes I just forget about it. I just like just forget about it. Why is it? Well, you were saying that uh, the the year series like you have to play number two and number three with a map because otherwise it gets it gets just too confusing. Actually, actually I gotta go. Okay, no worries, dude. Thank you again, Paul, for saving my day. Thank you for the raid, my man. Have a good night. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to build my CP here, I feel like. No, just number two and last part of one, I kind of... But in order to beat one, you need to play... Oh, gotcha, you have to get... Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, so I'm pretty much there almost. Oh, by the way, actually, I, I, is um, yeah, actually, I, I, I don't think homie when is here. By the way, yeah, I don't think homie when is here. By the way, so Chickaboo, you, you can be number one. Yay, go Chickaboo! Go chicka boom. Ah shit, he's here. <laughs> ah shit. <laughs> I thought, oh, chicka was gonna be number one now. Yeah, go chicka boos. But he's like, nope. <laughs> nope. Oh, where is it? So good, I mean, now it's... Okay, so where am I supposed to go here? So I'm supposed to go... Oh, in... oh yeah, the inn, yeah, the inn. Yeah, like, they would be here, right? Are they upstairs, or...? No, that's what I thought, yeah. Um... Oh, you play number three? Oh, the third one, gotcha, gotcha, no worries, mine. So good. I have, no, I have to mod Final Fantasy 7 and fix all the other games. Oh, on Steam? Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, I, I mean, I play number 7 without mods. I play number 8, I think, with the music mod. And I play number 9 with the um, that mod that everyone recommends you play. Miss Chloe. Everyone. Wow, that was scary. Thank goodness you're all safe. Pardon me, but what about the others? How is Matron, Teresa? Don't worry about her. her. They haven't woken up though, which has been little has, has been little work. If I may then, I'd like to see them. No doubt about it. Someone use a sleeping powder. Sleeping powder? Yes, there's still a faint hint of it in, in the air. It's probably the kind of without the side effects, so there's no real need for concern. And fix all my other games. Eight. Eight is yeah, but with eight I had to yeah, I had to mod the music because the the one version that I had on of Final Fantasy VIII um on Steam was the one that had the uh like the orchestra music. So it was it was different from the original. 
Hey, Clem, can you tell us what happened? I'll tell you. We were walking along the coast road with the bracelet lady, and this strange guy in masks showed up out of nowhere. The bracelet lady fought them for a while, but they were surrounded her. She fought them to save us and Matron Teresa. That's why uh, they're there. I must have been so scary. They, they took an envelope from Matron. Yeah. I wanted really bad to get a, back at it. Mr. Joshua, I couldn't help her. Don't think that way, Clem. I know that Matron Teresa would be happy that all of you are safe. That's why you must have blamed yourself. But I, um... I don't believe this. Who would do such a thing? Whoever it is, it must certainly be skilled at hiding his or her presence. After all, the brace that wasn't alerted, and Matron Teresa is unconscious. Chloe, I get the feeling that this was very deliberate. I'd say that the criminals were probably targeting the donations Matron Teresa had on her. If we find the money, we'll find the cul culprit. Yes, you're probably right. You see my little uh, comment earlier. Yes, in order to help the Matron in these kids, I must compose myself. Regardless, we must find who did this as soon as possible. She's right, you know. Oh, got it. I heard that what was going on at the guild. Looks like you've gotten wrapped up in one hell of a mess. Hey, don't make light of the situation. Karna got hurt too. I know that. So quit your japping. Karna's not amateur either. It takes someone pretty skilled to beat her. How about you give me a quick rundown of what's been going on here? Okay. I want the rest of the Pixel Master to come out and I'm tempted to buy the 3D games. The 3D games? What do you mean? To buy the 3D games? Where? Which games do you mean? Like the 3D games? Alright then. There's definitely something weird going on. Weird how? Well, there's the thing, you know, the uh, Raven Gang that was hanging out at the warehouse. They are gone now. Warehouse is empty. Then, they must be the ones who assaulted Matron Teresa. I'm not so sure about that. I really doubt they have what it takes to get the upper hand on Karna. Yeah, that's true. They took a big game, but I don't think they could back it up. Yeah, give them a single hard look and they shut it right up. However, today, they're suddenly nowhere to be found. Com couple that with today's still incident, and what do you get? Like I said, something weird is going on. Even if they are not directly responsible for the fire, I do feel like they are involved somehow. Yeah, but this ain't the time to go checking that out. Come on, Greenhorns, let's go. What are you talking about? Where are we going? You slow in the head or something? You obviously were going to the side side path where the crime happened. How those idiots did it so some, uh, doesn't matter right now. We've got to focus on finding some of the clues as to where they are. Oh, true. Understood. We'll help. Uh, yeah. Final Fantasy 4 and 3. Oh, yeah. Gotcha. 3 and 4, yeah. I bet 3 are playing Pixel Master is weird. Why is it weird? Oh, because, yeah. Because of the way that it looks. Yeah, it's got the uh, Super NES look to it, not the Nintendo DS one. Wow, how did you get how did you get to be so late? Bah, this is no good. How are we supposed to catch her in the door? Hey, what was that sound? Oh, Stitch, where have you been? What the hell? That's Stitch. Uh, his Chloe's um, gear falcon companion. We are as long as friendly. Scree. Scree, scree. Understood. Thank you, Siege. Scree. No, I've seen everything. So, Missy, what did your friend tell you? The the whereabouts of the ruffians who assaulted the Teresa, ev uh, evidently. It seems that the, he saw the attack. Haha, <laughs> that's a good one. Let's go and sort, Siege. Yes, most impressive. Scree. Now, wait one wait minute. You mean to tell me you actually believe that lot of bull? We've seen this him communicate several times. Yeah, if you don't believe us, you don't have to come along. Come on, guys. All right. Scree. Not the looks, the character are generic on your nights with no names. Oh yeah, gotcha. Yeah, well, in, in number three, yeah, the, the one that with the Nintendo DS, I think you had to do something online to unlock the Onion Knight class. Yeah, because when I did my playthrough, I didn't unlock Onion Knight at all, because apparently you have to do it online somehow. Oh, okay, so we have to heal up. Wait up, guys, you punks. Okay, well, so let's heal. We have a fight coming up. Does yeah. seem like it's um like it's coming in on something, but come on. Are we really following that thing? Is this your idea of a joke? It's not funny. It's a joke. The matron and the children are the family team. Fine then. I thought you were janking my cha my chain, but I guess I'll tag along. Jeez. Why don't you say that you really what you really think? 
All that set aside, we need to get going after Siege. Okay. So, can I go back though? Yeah, I can go back. So, can I sleep at the inn or. Yeah, I want to rest quickly. <laughs> it's a, a sorry stitch, but we have to wait now because uh, we need to heal. <laughs> so hold up. Oh, so I guess I have to go all the way up north. Yeah, okay. I, I see where we have to go. Yeah. Yep. Isn't that the way to the lighthouse? Um, let's go check it out. Yep. So I'm gonna I'm gonna save here just in case we do need to like. In case we lose and everything. I wanted to like do some grinding or something. So Varin Lighthouse. This actually reminds me of um Golden Sun. Because Golden has Golden Sun has lighthouses for like the dungeons. Just as I thought. The Varin Lighthouse. It belongs to the city of Ron. If I remember right, there's a man who lives here alone. This appears to be the place. I'm almost positive that the ones who attacked Matron, Teresa, and the children are here in this building. Which means that there's a high chance that the perpetrators have taken over the lighthouse. Oh, really? And from the looks of it, that seems to be the only entrance. I guess that all there is left to do is to check it out for ourselves. Okay. Now, hold on. There a minute, girl. I want to see the truth with my own eyes. What the hell are you talking about? I want to know why someone would do such a whole horrible thing, so please, tell me with you. I can see where you're coming from, but... Come on, don't act all thing now. The only reason we knew about this place to begin with was because of Chloe, and I can guarantee she can't handle herself. So at least you don't have to worry about her getting in the way. So Joshua, fine, have your way. But I hope you remember that these guys are the, are the ones who put Karna out of commission. Make sure you don't let them... Yeah, I'll keep that in mind. I guess it's decided then. All right, let's hurry and check this place out. Okay. I guess I wonder if there's gonna be enemies here. Oh, okay. These guys again? Aren't they the ones from before? I swear, if I wasn't looking at them with my own eyes, I'd never believe it. Hey, what the hell are you guys doing here? The Raven Gun members' eyes are blank and emotionlessness. Hey, look out! What are they getting this turn from? Oh, so somebody's controlling them. Okay, somebody's doing the same thing that happened with the um, the boss of the Sky Bandits. Team, you son of a... Um, how did you go with the testing? Oh, no, what problem? Doing okay. Uh, I get my results on Thursday, so on Thursday I'll be going to the doctor after work. This is just perfect. Now, I don't know what kind of drugs you're smoking, but if you have to meet some sense back into you, I will. Okay. Check down. Oh, the tip is done. Actually, I want to see what this guy does because I haven't really used him. Oh, I think he only really uh, he. Yeah, his yeah, his mostly physical, yeah, his physical damage. God damn, dude, he's actually very strong. But you know, doing pretty good, my dude. Doing all right so far, so that's kind of nice. Soul infusion. Oh no, he moved out. Damn it, he moved out of the um the area. Yeah, so I think I want to kill the wine that, yeah, I can... Oh, really? Oh, okay. So wait, so... Do you... I'm saying that I should go back? Should I go back and do that or not? Nah? 
So is that what you're saying? That I should go I should go back or not? Damn it. Fuck. <sighs> Ooh, you're kidding me, dude. Fuck. Like, like I heal here. Oh, I can't do it now, damn it. Gotcha. Yeah, so yeah, I want to yeah, I want to kill this boss. Yeah, he's the one I, I need to get rid of. You can open this slot if you want. Yeah, oh, yeah, I'll do it later. Yeah, I'll do it later. Yeah, that's the attack. Yeah, it always kills people. Yeah, it always kills stuff. Yeah, it does like a massive amount of damage. Like it does like, I think it's supposed to be like a one shot kill, anyways. Okay, so we got these guys. Cool. I can't believe it. These guys are a hundred times stronger than we're dealing with them at the warehouse. They appear to be acting rather strange. I wonder what's going on. Mm, looks like they're being controlled by someone. Controlled? Yeah, that's what I thought, yeah. Yeah, I agree. I say it's some sort of special uh, hypnotic in induction using a combination of drugs and suggestion. This allows the person to control the, the, to draw out their maximum physical potential. Can someone really do that? Of course, uh, but they need to be pretty skilled to even attempt such a thing. And I can only think of one group that could possibly pull something off like that. You have an idea of who might be responsible? Yeah, possibly. But there's no, no time to think about it now. Let's get upstairs. The real perpetrators should be up there. Alright, let's go. So let me really heal here. Okay, let's go here. Yeah, hey, here they come again. It looks like we don't have any choice but to put them down. Okay, damn it. Okay, so one more fight again. Okay, so yeah, so we have to look at yeah, we have to look at the ones that have the most HP because they have the ability to like to heal the others. Okay, so now we yeah, that's the one. Yeah, so we want this one. Yeah, yep. Yeah, so we want this one here first. Yes, yeah, so we want that one to. Oh, come on, don't miss that. Damn it.
Wow, they're really going for a gotcha now, damn, dude. They're really going for a gotcha now. Holy shit. Oh, come on, I got you. Why you keep missing at that, bro? Seriously. Oh, wow, okay. Wow, they really want to, like... Well, why are they going for him so hard? Like, they're really, like, going for him. Like, really, really going for it. Wow. Okay. All right, dude. Is he actually keep missing like that, bro? He hasn't hit a, a, a single shot, I swear to God. Thank God, dude. Got him. Uh, I mean, he can open his bloody ass. Oh, God. They just keep... Oh, it's kind of frustrating, honestly. Because they, they do that, like, the finisher. Like, even if... Yeah, even if they about to go down, they just do, like, a massive amount of damage. It's crazy. Okay. Rocco, I'm sorry about, about this. I, re I really don't want to fight with anyone being controlled, but this is the. Yeah. We don't need to kill them, just knock them out. Okay, so we got more guys here. Okay. So, yeah, we know what to do here. We know that we need to go always for the middle one, because he's the one who's gonna be. Okay, so they moved. Shit. Okay, they're going for her now, fucking assholes. Hey, you hear that? Oh, this guy. Oh, this guy. He he he. I job all done. Now we will we'll be able to blame this mess on those punks and everything will be working properly. So I take it that you're satisfied with your work. Yes, you've handled things nicely. But just to make sure, we haven't left any incriminating evidence, right? Ah, uh, you've got nothing to worry about. Even when those fools regain their senses, they won't remember anything. The housekeeper shouldn't wake up until early in the morning. I'm relieved to hear that. With this, the mess run of that orphanage should give up on the dreams of rebuilding it. And the series of incidents along with this arson will end up looking like the work of those low lives. We can get those two beds with the one stone, it's perfect. We're glad to see that our clients are happy with their work. However, if you don't mind asking me, what's the benefit of destroying the orphanage? That's one of the things that I've been having a hard time understanding. Ha! Palsy. Um, police, if you really want to know so far, I'll let you know in a secret. The mayor intends to transform the entire area into. Yeah, see? That's what I was yeah, that's what I was saying from the beginning. Yeah. Interesting. A scenic seaside area not far from Run City. 
What more favorable is uh, geographic conditions could could there be than that for a vacation home? We'll build lavish states with her and send then sell them off to the highest bidder. That's been the see. So he was in on this all along. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. So like the mayor, he seemed to be too nice, but he was so kind that it became a bit so it it, it became a bit, you know, um, suspicious. Now that's a ritzy plan if you've uh, I've had one, but I still don't get why it was necessary to burn the half an inch the ground. Ha, ah, think about it. Imagine trying to sell a extra state to someone with a ramshackle place like that, Marin, Marin the view. Not to mention all the tiny little brats running around close by are making a ruckus. I see something like that would definitely cut their value in half. But instead of going to an extreme like that, why not just buy up the place? Ha! You didn't really think that stubborn woman would sell off the land left to her by the late husband, did you? And if we were able to haul away the burnt the burnt or remains while they were away and build something in this place, there's not much they could do, do they? Ha ha ha, and since they have so much money, no money to rebuild this place, they'll have no choice but to accept their fate. That was your reasoning? How long have you guys been standing there? Or something like that? You heard my Trent Teresa and the children, and burned down their memories to ashes. You deprived those children of their smiles for that. How did you know we were here? But before that, what are those lowlifes doing downstairs? Too bad for you, they're taking a long nap. And to think that the mayor was behind it all, plus some faces we've seen we've seen before to be able to. So you know who we are, do you? We have been briefly acquainted with the redhead bracer before. Ha! So running off like dogs with the hotels between your legs and, and sizing to monsters on me means we're acquainted, huh? But now I finally got to where I want you. Kill them! Kill them! Now that they, they've seen my face, I can't let them walk out of here alive. It's unfortunate that you've fallen this far, Gilbert. Well, since this is the quest from our client, I guess we'll have to comply. Let's see what you got. What you've got, bracers. This is exactly what I was thinking. Just because you're help, you hired help, don't, don't think you are any less responsible. I think it's time to make you taste the power of the heavy blade. Okay, so it's only two enemies, though. Hmm, two enemies. I wonder what that is. So what do I have to do? With, uh... Oh, they can paralyze. Really? Yeah, I've got nothing to heal with. Yeah, I've got nothing to heal. Um, paralysis. Wow, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Um Yeah, having CP, ooh. Okay. Yeah, it's always good to have it just in case, have some CP saved up. This can't be. Gilbert, steward of the mayor, and you boys in black. In accordance with the law of the Bracer Guild, you're in Herba, place under arrest. Give it up and surrender. Er, you're pretty tough, I'll give you that. Going to the door with you hasn't disappointed me at all. Uh, the lieutenant's going to be mad. He warned us about this. We shouldn't have been as careless as we are. We were. The lieutenant, do you mean the guy wearing the red mask who was negotiating with the Sky Bandits? I'm surprised you know about that. It looks like you dogs from the guild are better at sniffing things out than we thought. Your insults are pretty funny considering that we just gave you a serious beatdown. 
Now hurry up and throw down your weapons and surrender. Sorry, we can't do that. Huh? What do you think you're doing? Don't move. Come any closer and this guy's friends are going to splatter all over this place. What is the meaning of this? What do you intend to do by threatening your employer? You're wrong about that. You're not an employer. The mayor's. But whether it was you or the mayor here, the outcome would have been the same. We only cooperated with you because we share a middle interest. And we, could care, we couldn't care less whether you live or die. Please, don't shoot. Don't shoot me. Cut the tears and the crap. Don't think you can get away by trying to fool us with a show like that. Ugh, my leg, my leg! Gilbert! Ugh. Looks like they were serious about the, what they said. If this isn't, this isn't enough of a show for you, then how about we blow the brains out of the housekeeper? It has nothing to do with this. If this, his life means everything to you, then I suggest you back up. Let's see, like over by the stairs, since we don't have much of a choice. Aha, that's right. Do what you're told like the dogs you out. And it looks like this is where we bid you farewell. No, wait! Don't you think you're getting away with this time? Okay, so they run away. Wee! <laughs> Wee! A rope. These guys are seriously prepared for anything. I'm leaving you to take care of the idiots, Stuart, and the rest. What? I'm going after these guys. The rest of you report to Jen and ask him for further instructions. Alright, me too. Alright, me too. Hold on, Sel, don't you just hear what you just, I said? We just can't forget about Gilbert and those guys from the Raven Grand. That's right. And though I think Gilbert got what he was coming to him, he's still hurt. Alright. I had to say this, but I guess I have to leave the rest up to Agatha. But I want to go help him there. Thus, in the end, Estelle and the others were able to take back the stolen money without his incident. By the time the mayor's steward and the group of delinquents were safely locked up in the Menoria windmill shed, morning had already broken. Okay. Now then, I'll keep an eye on things here. Could you return to Ruan and report back to Jin? That's fine with me, but are you sure you'll be okay? Come on. I just got a whiff on a sleeping powder, is all. It'll happen a little too fast for me to remember who attacked me, though. Oh, wait, really? Do you have one more fight? Don't beat yourself about it. You still managed to fend off the attackers. The children are safe thanks to you. I can't thank you enough. Ah, well, I guess there's at least that. Still, will Agatha be okay facing them on his own? I know he's tough and all, but it still worries me. Yeah, if they somehow manage to get the drop on him... For now, we just have to trust that he knows what he's doing. He's been after those guys for a while now. He knows how they work, so I think he'll have a tough time taking on him. Yeah, I guess you're right. I we'll just have to focus on what we can do. You're right. You're exactly right. I'll hang on to the donated money until the Matron wakes up if those guys want it. They'll have to pry it from my cold dead fingers. You can count on me. I'll be fine, so you go ahead. Alright, be careful. Let's go. Okay, so we managed to do that fight. So if there's one more fight coming up, I feel like I have to build up my CP. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna have to build up my CP again. So like, yeah. Mm. Dalmor was behind everything. He was just pretending to be all kind and everything from the start. Mm, I've been kind of wondering about this, but will he be able to catch the mayor this time? Huh? So this is a good question. This may be difficult. The basic guild has non-interference policy when it comes to government affairs, and considering he has control over the whole run region, arresting the mayor isn't going to be easy. Hold on just a second. Doesn't anyone else find that strange? It is funny, but the law is the law. That's why the guild can have branches everywhere, even in the uh, Erevonian Empire. Yeah, but still. Anyway, let's just get to the guild and talk to Jen. I think he'll have some useful advice for us. Okay. I'm fine. Don't worry about me. You just need to make the man in charge paid to stab. That's right. Alright. Yeah, I wanna get some CP here, right? Because we have to do a fight, right, Chickaboo? I'm sure. Yeah, I wanna just get, build some CP if I need to. Oh, 
Yeah, those sharks are pretty easy. I mean, are we coming to the end of it, or like, how we got we left to, to go? I guess, yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, I guess, how much more have we got left to go, then? I wonder. Yeah, I don't want to follow those guys. They're so annoying, because they're paralyzed like a motherfucker. Oh, can I? Okay, yeah, I'll try it. Yeah, that's true. I might do it then. We're holding on, yeah, I'll do it. I'll hold on the uh, Trevor. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's true, yeah. So, yeah, so you move faster. Cool. Yeah, we. Much faster. Yeah, one more fight then. Oh, I gotcha. So, one more fight. <laughs> yeah, because you got yeah, because you can actually yeah, you can quickly go through the uh, the game. All right, we're good to go. And, yeah. So you have to go through like yeah, walk back back and forward, um, having to okay. Uh, what is it, Clive? Well, are you guys going to the guild? I just remember something I need to do. So can you guys go ahead without me? I'll catch up to you shortly. That's fine. Are you going to back to campus then? Yes. I think I should report in to the Hazmaster and let him know what's happening. Okay, I got it. We'll be waiting for you at the guild. I'm sorry, still. You too, Yushua. Wait. Chloe produced a notepad and pen and began scribbling furiously. This ought to do it. Stitch. Well, what is what is it up to? Understand. It's just hard to believe that Mayor Delmore is behind these recent events. It's certainly a major incident. So, Jean, do you think the mayor can be caught? Well, I'm afraid it's going to be rather difficult. The only way, the only way it'll really, it'll really happen is if he can be caught in the act. I fear as much. You can't be serious. So we just have to allow a corrupt mayor to stay in power. Now, now, there's no need to be panic. The Basic Guild's hands might be tied, but the Royal Army can get him. Oh. Estelle Joshua, I'd like to, for you to go to the Mayor's state and question him. It doesn't matter if he gets angry, just want you to buy him some time. And you'll con contact the Royal Army in the meantime. Haha, <laughs> precisely. I contact uh, Leiston Fortress headquarters with the Orbital Communications System to request assistance. I don't like having to rely on the Army, but I don't see any other options. Okay, once Chloe catches up to us, we'll go to see the Mayor at once. I made it. Sorry for the date, late. Not no, at all. Perfect timing, in fact. That's pretty quick for a run to the campus. Oh well, I'm pretty fast on my feet. So what's the plan? We were just talking about going to the mayor's state. We have to stall him with an interview while he's the Royal Army. Um, no, you can actually... You know, I think you can skip cutscenes to an, to an extent. Like, no, 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 skip them, but you can actually, like, go quicker. Like, the animations go quicker as well. Okay, so here I'll save after this gotcha. I see. Maybe that wasn't so necessary after all. Oh, so will you be coming with us? So please, allow me to accompany you. Well, we'll continue on you to contact to contact the army, Jean. Just leave it to me. Okay. Yeah, so yeah, so she's obviously up to something, right? She's obviously up to something. I mean, do I want to buy... I mean, do I want to buy more... Um, I think I should buy... S I think I, I can do something here, right? I'm pretty sure when it comes to... What should I buy here? Um... 
I need 300 for that again. Yeah, I don't know why I should be going without her. Okay, so let's go see the major. Where's the major again? I forgot. Actually, I think I've done... I've done one, right? Okay. So where's the mayor again? I forgot. He was, um... Oh, do I want to buy? Do I want to buy this for her or no? Cause I feel like she might betray me though. I feel like she might betray me. That's my issue with um. Like, do I want to make her stronger? <laughs> this feels like she might betray me. That's the only thing. Where's the major? Oh, yeah. There you go. My space is massive. It's really doing all the nasty stuff in a place like that. this nice. I don't think that really matters. My uh, major is alarm, uh, the more is originally from a large family of nobles. I think this estate has been passed down for generations. Okay, so the stay wasn't paid in foreign blood. At least that's something. Anyway, we need to find out him out and question him. My game doesn't never opens. Look at the fast forward. Yeah, no. <laughs> we. Welcome to the run of my young estate. I'm terribly sorry, but the mayor is currently attending to some guests. Perhaps you could come back by another time. What? No, hold on. Just one second. I'm pretty sure we know who the guest is. It's Duke Duan, isn't it? Wait, that's actually. Have you received an invitation as well? Yes, it came directly from the mayor himself. I apologize for the inconvenience, but would you mind? Now that I take a closer look, you appear to be bracers. If circumstances demand it, then please go on. The mayor and Duke are in the banquet hall on the south second floor. Excellent. Thank you for the help. Alright. With so many guests arriving, I really must prepare some tea. Please pardon me. So I'm guessing that, yeah, so I'm thinking that, that the Duke must be behind this as well, right? Oh, nothing. Uh, I was just thinking how impressive it was you. It was that you knew that it was you. Oh, uh, it's just a matter of asking the right questions. He's planning to sell vacation homes to the rich, remember? Duke Dunan might as well have a bullseye target painted on his uh, Miss Hapen head. What up, poison milk? You better stay in those forever. Actually, the lockdown is ending today in Brisbane, at least. Apparently. But uh, in Sydney and Melbourne, it still is for like indefinitely, apparently. That's smart thinking. Where'd you, where'd you come up with that line about the mayor inviting us? It wasn't a line. But how's it going, Poison Milk? How are you, mate? <laughs> That's true. <laughs> he did invite us over the first time we met him. <laughs> if those ravens start making trouble again, I feel free to drop by and let me know or something like that. Oh, that's right. Haha, <laughs> so he was... he did divide us. Exactly, well, why don't we head up to the banquet hall? Okay. So... up here, yeah. There you go. I like the sound of that. Run would be perfect place for a vacation home. I think I might stay for a while. <laughs> I had a feeling you'd think so. I'll see if uh, that you get the finest place available, my lord. I believe you'll be quite satisfied. Haha, <laughs> you're quite the smooth, smooth uh, talker. But good, money is no object. Prepare me an estate that is worthy of your future king. Make it as splendid as your holdings here. 
pardon me, my lord, but wait a moment. The queen asked you to consult with her before expanding such an amount of... Silence, Philip. I am the one... I am next to the... I am to be the next king. Oh, God. But how's it going, Poison Dude? How are you, my man? Welcome, welcome, welcome. It's been a while. Oh, God. Best purchases are every day for a man of my standing. Yes, of course. Well said, Your Grace. We can get a written contract together shortly. But first, one more drink. Oh, hell. How are things in uh, Florida? Is it hot? Is it humid? Are there alligators? I uh, came here just to prime stuff. Oh, nice, dude. Thank you, dude. Appreciate it, my homie. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What a fuck. Yeah, well, it's winter here, so in the US it would be uh, summer, so hot. And there's always alligators. <laughs> have you ever had to, like, like, have you, I'm sure you've seen one, right? But have you seen any on the streets and so on? Hi there. Greetings from the Bracer Guild. You. What do you people want? You look like kind of familiar. Oh, it's you. Hi, Mr. Butler. We just dropped by to talk to the mayor. No biggie. This one, do. If you're here on guild business, you should speak with someone uh, semblance of matters. I'm in the middle of an important discussion, so why don't you come back later? I apologize for your uh, our rudeness, mayor. We intend to no, we intend no disrespect. We simply came to report to that you that we have identified the arsonist. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, then I suppose, my lord, we excuse us for a moment. Uh, say what you're going to say here. This sounds interesting, but it's okay. Maybe the duke will have something to add. It won't add any harm for him to hear this, will it? Well, if you, if you must. While we are on this subject, it seems that the, the Matron Teresa was attacked again last night. Could the arsonists be the like thing to that? It seems very likely. Unfortunately, the attackers are still at large. I see. But still, at least you say you know who they are now. So who did it? Who indeed? It is exactly who you think it is, my young Lord. I see, that's quite a, quite a shame. I was hoping I could make them see the error of their ways before it was too late. I suppose that there was a that um I suppose that was a vain hope on my part. Uh who are you talking about, Mr. Mayor? What do you mean, who? Why, the Ravens, of course. They be ha they've been hiding in ever since last night. I'm sorry, sir, but they are responsible. This time they claim to be victims themselves. What? So without further ado, the culprit is Oh wait, wait. So do I say that it was him, like the mayor, or do I say that it was um, Gilbert? <laughs> I'm not sure. I mean, like we know that it's him, but like, we know that it's him. But like, do I want to make, do I want to make it a scene? You, Mayor Delmore. We already have Gilbert in custody, and we know everything. We also have proof that you stole the money donated to restore the orphanage. Your lucky set on fire. Can you deny the search? Nonsense. Do you think I know those people in the black clothes? Well, not strange. We didn't say anything about black clothes. This is absolutely ridiculous. Gilbert was acting alone. You don't know when to give up, do you, old man? We know that you were plotting to build vacation homes on the land the orphanage occupied. Do you still deny the charges laid against you? Persistent little brats. But I've had those development plans in, in place for ages. They're just part of the ruins city planning. What reason would you would I have to be so impatient that I resort to criminal acts? Well, how about a mountain of debts to pay off? Ah, um, Neil, what are you doing here? I figured I'd come to the mayor's place to do some investigating. When I see the you two going in, the whole thing smells fishy, and I decided to sneak in. That's it, in a nutshell. Just who the hell are you? Oh, I am a reporter with the Liberal News. The name's Neil Burns. Actually, I've been checking into the city's financial affairs recently. And what do I see that the mayor, Dalmore, has been diverting funds from the city budget lately? That, I, that's, they're funds for the expansion project. I'm not buying it, you haven't even started construction. I thought it was kind of strange, so I dug deeper and I found links to the airship company services. Now, that was quite the little surprise. One year ago, it took more than a few trips to the Cal... Calvart Republic. I, I was just sightseeing. A reasonable claim, but the truth is that you've amassed a nice big debt over there, am I right? You loosen me how? By using town funds to speculate in risky commodities in the hopes of cashing in, buying goods when they're cheap, selling them when they're high, that kind of thing. But I get it, so how much do you lose? 
from my fellow reporters over there told me something like the chin of uh, 100 million Mira. 100 million Mira? That's 100 times the amount of donated to the Alphanish buildings. I can certainly see why one might try to crime over an amount that high. A hundred million? I'm pretty, f I'm pretty free with my spending, but I've got nothing on you. This isn't a competition, you know. Now that you mention it, he took funds from the city budget to pay off the debts and stay off any questions. But I can't understand why he would turn to arson and theft to, bu to build his vacation homes. It just all seems so random. Where is your proof? Go ahead and run your story with all its wild speculations. I'll sue you and the newspapers for the world. Suddenly confident, are we? And you all, the rest of the guild does not have the authority to arrest me. I, I am the mayor. I want you all out of here now. I guess he's right. He knows his rights. Mayor, may I ask you one more question? What now? What is a student of the Royal Academy doing associating with such people? Disgraceful. Return to the campus at once. Floyd looked Mayor Dolphin directly in the eyes, his expressions cold and stern. Why did you not use your own assets to pay off your debt? 100 million Mira is certainly not a lot of money, but I think the House of Moore surely has enough assets to settle his matter. The state, for instance, it would easily sell off for at least 100 million Mira. Don't be ridiculous, the state has been done, has handed out to, in the Dalmore family for generations. How could I ever simply let it go? The orphanage was no difference, for many of us it was a place fond, fondly, fondly remembered, remembered. No one has the right to destroy something like that. How could you use such a thing? How dare you liken the state to the dilapidated old hovel? You care for no one but yourself, more than being a mayor or being the head of the house still more. You pitiful man. You have quite a way with words, young lady, but let's see if you'll change your tune in a few minutes. Okay. Hello. Dango! Franco, come, it's dinner time. What's up? The smell. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh, what? What the hell are those things? Monsters. Uh. My lord. Unbelievable. You actually kept monsters as pets. Hee hee hee. Everything you think you know will die in with you here. Don't worry. If there's anything left of you, I'll dump it in with the, in the river. Ha 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 ha. It's crazy. Ah, oh, shit. Grrr. So he's fighting freaky monsters, part of the selling plan now. Well, at least now we can arrest him for trying to kill us. I'm sure the one the other stuff will stick to after this. I bear you both know your will, but I will not allow you to harm anyone. What the hell? Some big doggos here? God damn, dude. Okay, that's not nice of him. So which one should I go for? I think, yeah, I should go for Bronco first. Yeah, I, yeah, so I'm gonna go for one first. I'm gonna go for the, the smaller one first. Drunk costumes. Oh, so they got poison. Fuck, they got poison. Wow, okay. Yeah, I need to heal here. Oh wow, dude. Are you serious? Fucking Christ. Wow, okay. Wow! Okay, this fight is actually fucking hard. Okay, oh yeah, I think I'm fucked now. Yeah, okay, I lost it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, I need to revive Ace up. I can't just let him, yeah. Yeah, okay, let me try. Okay, so what do we have to do? Okay, so what do we do in this fight? Um. So yeah, you know, yeah, I saved, I saved, yeah, I saved. Mm. Yeah, I saved before the um, before the um, the long, the long cutscene with the mayor. So let's go for Bronco first. Yeah, Bronco's the one that needs to go for. Yeah, yeah the, the fight is that the poison. See. That's my biggest issue. 
I have to, yeah, I didn't know that the poison, so I have to use the poison uh, necklace. See, the poison is actually so strong. Oh, damn it. She won't get healed, though. Fuck. Wait, wait, what? They stun too? What the fuck? Wait, they stun too? No way. Fucking Christ, dude. They actually stun too. Dude, really? Yeah. It's just the fact that they stand as well, like that's actually really annoying. Hey, pay oh wait, they even resist that too? Oh wow, you can't you, you can't even taunt them off people. Oh what the fuck? So they do a stun and poison. Fuck, if i known that, I could've just... Fuck. Yep. Wait, you kill one and they get... What? You kill one and they get that too? They get like the thingy? The, um... Like a buff? Wow, okay. That's, that's bullshit, but I guess that's... I have to move here. I need to move here. Fucking Christ, man. That is so bullshit, dude. Like, you kill one and they heal each other? Wow, okay. That's fucking annoying. Oh, come on, don't go after the fucking stall now, you bitch. Oh, you fucking asshole. Oh, come on, I should've just... Mm, man, that's annoying.
Look at him. Ooh. Okay, we got it. All right, we got it. That's that then. Let's move out. Ooh, okay, yeah, yep. Yeah. Oof. It can't be. My sweet babies. How could you do this? You're one to talk. In accordance with the Grace Guild Protocol, and this time with authority, we're placing you under arrest. Surrender now, or you will not be harmed. Ha ha ha. Limited choice, but to use my trump card. I won't. Time stop. Oh shit, he understand. I can't move. I'll get you know. Kelly is good, but like, ah, oh, I just. Did he use an herbal art? No, this has to be an artifact. So what the hell is that? Well, well knowledge is impressive with, with uh, Miss Rins. This is the Chronos Rod, an artifact which happens to be a family heirloom. Can completely paralyze anyone within range in the blink of an eye. That's crazy. How does this church? How does the church not, not know about such a powerful artifact? Aha! With a tool crafted by the wise ancient themselves, what else would one expect? Tactical ornaments can even begin to compare to this. Sadly, it has only it only has that one function. Which means I'll have to sully my hands with and dispose of you myself. Hee <laughs> hee, you should consider this an honor. Let's see, I think I'll start with the smart mounted little butt first. Who are you calling smart mounted? Perhaps I'll save the intelligent girl for last. Hee <laughs> hee, now. What was that you sir you were saying about? Authority, you could plead for your lives. It might help, but, it, but I doubt it. To you? Yeah, right. Keep your filthy hands off. What's that? Keep your filthy hands off, Estelle. Don't you harm a single hair on her, or I'll use everything neat I know to cut my smith to cut to cut your miserable carcass to pieces. What, Joshua? Joshua, you certainly talk big for someone who can't even wiggle his fingers. Fine, I start with you. Stop! I'll never let you get away with hurting him. Joshua, die! No! What the? The light! Damn it! If I could just switch my camera. What, what's going on? I can move again. Stella, what was that black light? I don't know. But I think. It came from the armament that sent us. Impossible! My family heirloom, my artifact, is broken. It hardly matters since you've played your last hand. It's time to face reality. Yeah. I can't believe you really st stood this low. It's disgusting. Grr, I will not be taken in. Up to him, okay. Hey, what up? I can't get a story like this get away. Oh my, oh my, I, I believe I lost a few years of what I've, of what little reigns to me. My lord, are you right, my lord? Uh, monsters, the monsters. <laughs> So this should be the, like the last scene in this shot, I think. Hey, what's that? It's Mayor Delmore uh, Yard. Hey, wait. We can go after him and his boat. Come on, you two, get on board. We'll do it. All right. Hey, let me come on too. <laughs> Whoa, eek! It's a high speed uh, scene. High speed, boys. Alright, we're closing in. The scrap is small and lightweight, so we have uh, the edge, it seems. Pew! Damn stubborn, little. Take this! Pew, 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 pew! Yeah! <laughs> I'm a Jedi! What? That'll teach you not to underestimate a bracer. Joshua, flank him on the right. Wait. Did she seriously just reflect some fucking like bullets with a stuff? What the fuck, Stell? Right at that. Huh? How do you get so fast? The wind is blowing towards open water. It's catching his sail and giving him a boost. Not good. At the trade, the yacht has clear advantage. We won't be able to catch up. Say what now? Ah, it looks like Adios. It's not some easy way. I bid you farewell, brats. You gotta be kidding me. We're close. He's going to get away. There must be something we can do. What the? They're here. Alright, getting away is all well and good, but what now? I guess I have the choice but to head for the Empire. Or if I lie low for a while, maybe he... What? Oh, so this is the people that Estelle... So I don't know Estelle, um, Chloe called. Who, who are they? What is this airship? 
It's a royal army. No, the coat of arms is wrong. It's the royal guard ships, a high speed cruiser. Her name is the Arsaili. Well, well. Looks like we've got uh, here just in time. The blue and white uniform. Are you Her Majesty, Royal Guard? Precisely. I am the company commander, Julia Swartz. Mayor Doris Dunmore, everyone. I'm placing you under arrest for arson, robbery, and embezzlement, among other charges. This is a dream. This has to be. No, 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 no. What was going on? Jen called the Royal Army for reinforcement. How did you get here so fast? Oh, the bracers. The cooperation is really appreciated. Please let us handle this matter. No, they're gonna take all the credit. No, not again. I pressed by the more for information once you remain consciousness, but he apparently can't remember anything regarding the past few hours. Very well. If he remembers them all at all. He's also drawing a complete blank about the Hearts and Rune robbery. Really? Kind of like the leader of the Sky Bandits. Maybe it's related to those men in black from before. Well, even if he can't remember, the crimes are pretty clear at clear cut. He should go without saying that he will be checking out his store too. If we uncover anything, we'll be sure to let the bicycle know. We appreciate it. By the way, Lieutenant, I have a favor to ask. What might that be? Would it be all possible for me to get on board the ship as well? It's supposed to be the most advanced airship ever to come out of Sayus. It'd make for a pretty good story and a really neat one. I am afraid not. The uh, Ersaili was only just completed and is still undergoing flight testing. I must ask that you not comment on her at all until she's officially unveiled. Well, come on. You got to be at least give me something about the mayor and his tour being arrested. Don't worry, the facts of this story will be given over to the Royal News Agency. Until then, please refrain from reporting any of these. What choice do I have? Alright, I can do this. I can write a story with even the very scrap of info. I've got to hurry back to the agency and put these events to paper. If you're part of me, everyone, peace! Well, he's just in his usual side spirits. Ha, would you expect any less? I'm told that the liberal news circulation has increased dramatically of late. I hope he's not planning to write a big propaganda piece. What do you mean? Never mind. That was quite impressive, First Lieutenant Squats. Squats? Colonel. Whoa! Colonel Richard. Oh, I remember you. I presume that you are the new Bracer Gills I've spoken of. Oh, so you were the one with Jen got in touch with, Colonel Richard? Yes, I received word of Lais Laison Fortress, where the Royal Army Royal Forces are stationed. I got here as quickly as I could, only to find that the, tri the crisis had passed. Excellent work, Lieutenant. That's very kind of you, sir. Ah, I still wonder, what would you, uh, what would bring the guards from the Royal City here, suddenly? Perhaps you know a route so secret that even our intelligence division is aware of. Surely, you, 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 you just... Uh, come on, Captain, this is a hardly time to pick a fight. Or simply admiring the proactive stance of the Royal Cosmond, it's good to have you on our side. If it pleases you, Lieutenant, we'll take over the investigation from here and move matters to Laystone Fortress. I believe the Mayor will be attended there to there. Just to understand. Now, if you'll excuse me, ladies and gentlemen of the Grace Guild and Royal Army and their young lady in the uniform, if I will, if I willing, I think we shall see each other again. And with that, I'll be you farewell. Hee <laughs> hee. Safe travels, everyone. Oof. Maybe I'm just imagining things. Maybe, but did the colonel look like he was eyeballing Chloe to anyone else? Oh, was he? Oh! So Chloe and him are related. I get it. I get it. So they must be related somehow. To like, maybe siblings? Oh, was well, he? I'm sure it's just because he doesn't see the students very often in this kind of work. It wouldn't make much. I wouldn't make much of it. Nah, okay, I'll bet you're right. That's probably it. Mm, that's not impression at all. I'm certain that he's just as surprised as you are. It's hard to believe that he braces so young would be so capable. He might be scouting you out to become part of the Royal Argard. Chloe, huh? Come on, don't flatter us. We had a lot of help in this case. You needn't be so modest. You're not full-fledged bracers yet, but I presume that you wish to become so. Uh, well, yes, we're training for it. We intend to travel all over the country before the Queen's birthday as celebration as part of our preparations. I see you're uh, partaking in self-study then. Lieutenant, so that's everything is ready for the CEO departures. Acknowledge. Estella and Joshua and Chloe too, of course. We must be leaving soon. I hope that our paths will cross again. Rich. Yes, ma'am. We'll be looking forward to it. Thank you very much. 
Regiment, attention! Whoa! Royal Godsman Warship are slain. Prepare to take off. <laughs> they play music and everything? What the hell? Zoom. Well, a salute and vanguard to go with. That's a little overwhelming. Yeah, and a state of the art airship to boot. But I guess you expect as much from the defenders of their majesty, the Queen. Ha, ah, true. Lieutenant Squad sure is cool, though. She kind of reminds me of that character that Chloe played Oscar the Knight. I think so too. Ha, ah, what an odd coincidence. Scree! Oh, don't tell me the Royal Army Gasman showed up. And the art cell was there, too. She's supposed to be Cadogan. It's too bad I just worked in for this. I have to, I have liked to see that. I never figured you'd be you for the military uh, enthusiastic. But still, didn't you end up speaking to Colonel Richard? Yes, he was on duty at Layston headquarters. I don't know how the Gasman got there so weakly, though. I guess there's still a lot more cross communications in the military than I thought. Amazing that they managed to communicate at all, given how many agencies the regular army, border patrol, intelligence, and the Royal Army. It must be pretty complicated. Clean up after an incident like that, like this, will be a major undertaking. What will happen to the administration of Rwan from now on? Yeah, since we may have been arrested. I'd imagine there'll be something someone as acting mayor. As if Dalmor is found guilty, elections will be have to be held. Plus, preparations will probably be made towards the orphanage. And really, thank goodness. All of this is thanks to Estelle and Joshua. Thank you so much, truly. Oh, come on, you don't have to be so formal. We just did what we was right. Plus, it wasn't just us. I guess they played a big part. Speaking of, yeah, have you had? Have you received any word of him? Yes, but unfortunately, I'm afraid he wasn't able to capture the men in the black uniforms. They were not alone, apparently. A guy that was ambushed. Or what? Is he alright? Yeah, he managed to defeat them. I believe he gave chase and they're on their way to Z's. By now, they're probably well outside of Rwan. Wow, talk about hardcore. Well, he's got plenty of experience, after all. He'd been chasing those black blood clad characters for a while. I think they're related to a job your father asked him to do. But ask him. And I got it, just did what he asked. Well, well, the one to pull Agathe out of the Ravens in this place was none other than Cassius himself. And whatever he might like to claim, Agathe stood no chance against him. Or seriously, Cassius really beat some sense into him, and Agathe is too stubborn to simply say thanks and leave it at that. I get it. Maybe that's why he's so abrasive when it comes to us. Abrasive barely covers that guy's attitude. Guess he's not so high and mighty where that's involving, huh? Uh, speaking of your father, how about the Black Ormond that lift up the save our lives at the Mayor State? Oh yeah, that's right. So much has been going on that I forgot all about it. I wonder what was that all about? The Ormond might have saved our skins, but it was so weird. An unusually color Ormond, huh? What can you tell me about it? Well, I've been a package addressed to Cassius. Oh my, that's quite a story. From K asking about a Professor R. Could it be? You know their names, what it means? Not specifically, but I've got a hunch, but nothing to back it up. But if you want to know more about its origin, I suggest going to Seas. Why Seas? As you should know, Seas is, is a famous, is famous for the manufacture of ornaments. There must be someone there who might know something about the ornaments. Makes sense. We may never learn more about the black ornament without consulting an expert. But we still have more training here to finish. Haha, <laughs> well, about that you might want to prepare yourselves. Hey, we got recommendations! Really? Uh, you had, had to have seen that coming. I mean, you've got a recommendation from Bo Z after the Sky Bandits incident, giving you crucial roles in all the cases recently, as seen or reason not to award it. Your assessments and reward have been prepared. Cool. Well, all of this on top of the pay for performing in the campus festival. Thank you for everything you've done for us. Come on now, you've earned it. I confess, I'd like to see you advance as quickly as possible. I believe we'll be able to make the best of use of your talents this way. Uh, thank you, Jen. We'll do our best to love, live up to your expectations. Congratulations, both of you. I'll be kinda, it'll be kind of lonely here without you, though. Chloe, you're right. It'll be tough to say goodbye. Oh, please don't mind me. I'm just being selfish. Will you please tell me when you find out what day you're leaving? I'd like to see you off at least as far as the Earl Letton checkpoint. Yes! The end of chapter 2! That had so much dialogue. Holy moly. Okay. Safe. Well, going to live there, guys.